Well, welcome to my beloved tiny house. The time has unfortunately come for me to say goodbye to her, but in order for me to make sure she goes to the best owner, I wanna give you a tour showing you some of my favorite features and some things that make this tiny home really, really unique and special. So have a look. So this is the view right when you walk inside the door. I just have a little towel there to cover the under sink space. Lots of storage, antifreeze pipes, leading up to a large kitchen sink, plenty of space in the sink, lots of counter space here, beautiful cupboards, really wide, deep cupboards. They also have clamps here, so when you're traveling, you can, when the, the tiny home's being transported, you can do that. One of my favorite features is this custom woodworking. The crane is gorgeous. As you can see, that's in with the bamboo on the wood. Here's where we would eat our meals. We have another stool that um, we would put there. We have a little work desk, dining room area. Coming into the main room here. Um, it's dark here right now because the awning is put down, but usually that awning is up and that's a well-lit window. Space here for a couch. You could put um, however you want to design this little room. We have a little small space heater plugged in there. Um, hook for a TV if you would want. You could also put the TV up there in the rafters if you want a TV. Big window space with lots of bookshelves. The bookshelf paint is like a tan color, really neutral. And then we have one of my favorite features. It's a dwarf stove. Um, this is the fireplace and the fireplace opens and just a really sweet fireplace there. It gets so warm in the winter that um, sometimes we have to open the door. I also have just a box of wood here for the next owner. Wood is really expensive, so that's that. Upstairs, about five steps leading up to the loft and the loft is really comfy um i will show you that i can sit up on it here's the bed obviously you can see like lots of room enough to sit up easy to lay down in this is one of my favorite, most cozy nights of sleep is here in this tiny home. Um, also has the blinds, so you can open and add more light. Close. This mattress um, comes with the house. It's brand new memory foam. Super, super nice. So those lights over the bed work um, as well. Makes it really cozy up here. So you can sit up, but not quite stand. The steps are kind of steep, but that's the staircase leading up. Some of the custom woodworking, these are lights in the ceiling here. And then you can see it's a cedar ceiling. Really, really beautiful. Over here we have the Verona stove with storage under the stove. Good size oven. Um, you can put baking sheets. We always used a smaller baking sheet, but you can use bigger ones. Lots of shelving space around the stove. The custom stonework. A nice burner set. has four big ones. The fan. Of course, the above the stove storage. Nice size fridge. It's really nice, pretty inside with a big freezer. So, there's that. The brand is Avanti. And coming into the bathroom. Hi in the bathroom mirror. The bathroom sink, the toilet over here in the corner. It has ventilation that goes out this window as well. And then we have the water hookups here. We have the Renai um, water heater. This is an automatic hot water heater. All the plugins here that you'll need. We have the compost toilet. Here's where the washer dryer hookups are. That's the chimney for the tiny home. And then this is all the, that's the AC unit hookups right there for hot and cold water. If you wanted to do the washer dryer, that's where it would go. 
Over here, we have one of the closet spaces. You can see a big space for storage, more storage, and even more storage with some outlets there. A nice big shower. One of my favorite features is the stonework. The stone is from the Colorado River. Also enough space here that you really could put a bathtub in. Let me zoom out a little to show you. But you could have a big bathtub in here. It's kind of sized for that. You um, can also have this window open and you have the shower. Lots of shower shelving here. This is kind of the view from inside the shower. Then we have two big drawers, sizable drawers, pretty deep. And a heater here. This will come with the tiny home as well. Some of the mornings you'll need a heater before the fire is made, but a space heater just heats the place just fine. Another closet, and then you have the space for storage above the closet as well. Beautiful wood beam work in through here. And we'll just do one more big zoom out tour. There we go. The gorgeous kitchen, dining table, the fireplace. Beautiful chandelier.